The occupational hazards are tremendous. The work, hands on. And the job requirements aren't for the faint of heart. But the men and women of the Syracuse Fire Department wouldn't have it any other way. There's a nice adrenaline factor to it. We have a lot of fun here, but at the same time, we have a ton of responsibility. And that's a fine line we walk. Some people might think we're a little, we're laughing one minute and the next second we're running out the door on things that most people don't want to see or deal with or be in the middle of. There is no normal. Uh, Syracuse Fire Department is not put out house fires. There's so many other things that we do. From car accidents to cardiac arrests, Syracuse Fire is on call and on the scene of any imaginable emergency. In this line of duty, the job is constantly changing. Just when you think you've seen everything or you've heard everything or you've, or you've learned everything, you haven't. I mean, there's just so many different types of situations that you can be thrown into and you need to be able to react. In tonight's 14-hour shift, the men and women of Engine 1 go from chefs to car washers to EMTs, snow removers, and of course, firefighters without missing a beat. It's not work, it's just part of my routine at this point. It's you're doing and you never know what's going to happen, which is kind of a, a, a nice factor to things. It's a calling that for so many here is just in the blood. It's a, it was a family thing for me. I, I come from a long line of firefighters. Uh, I'm actually a fourth generation firefighter. I started with my great grandfather back in 1913. My mother's father was on uh, from the 50s and the late 70s. My father came on in 84, just retired a couple years ago. and. Here I am, and uh, little brothers down at Station 8 as well. All Syracuse firefighters back in 1913, in fact, back before they even had motorized vehicles. I have a picture of my great-grandfather with the horses. Though actual family ties run deep in the world of firefighting, in the long hours, sacrificed holidays, and dangerous scenarios, second families are forged at each station. The relationships that you, you truly form with the guys that you work with. I mean, they're, they're selfless, selfless people, guys and, and, and girls that just come to work every day and, and give everything they've got. And without the team effort that you have with you, nothing can be done. And they never know what the next alarm may bring. In Syracuse, Kelly Cowan reporting.